Hello guys, welcome to SI Technologies. Today we are going to discuss another interview question. This question is asked in XOL, second round of interview. So it's a final round for the candidate selection. So the question here, the SQL question which they have asked, the input is here, whatever the input which we are saying, right? The employee ID name, and in employee ID, we do have a one, two, three, four, and the name which contains Vera and Vera, and as well as if you observe the data, second row, which contains three E's, and as well as followed with RE. And if you go with the third, which is having four E's, and as well as followed with RE. And when it comes to four, fourth one, you have a three E's after that follow, and again N D E N. So the output which they are expecting here, employee ID one comma four. How it is going to be differentiated? If you see the data in name, Vera, and as well as V V V E U E R E N D E N. So the expectation which they are making as part of this, so very simple. Okay, they wanted to have a data. Okay, they wanted to have a data like you know, which contains only double E's and it shouldn't be followed with additional E, additional E. Okay, what it meant, for example, if you if you understand this case, okay, if you understand this case, okay, specifically on this particular case, what it has happening, okay, if you see the that, if you see the data, okay, if you see the data, specifically on Vera, so here you see Vera is present, double E is present, and when it comes to here also, it is present E, and later point of time, once we see, right, E, after that it is followed with other characters, other characters, other than E. So when it comes to here, you see E, e is present, okay? And then here you see additionally E, additionally E. And at the same time here you, you, you see E, e and again here you see e, e. So they don't want this output, this output as part of, as part of the output, as part of the output. So how can we solve this? How can we solve this particular thing? So here, okay, I have already created as well as I have already provided the solution as well. So let me explain you in detail this particular solution. First of all, regular expression like. So it has to get, it has to have some expression. First, try to go with the select start from table. Okay, select start from table. If you go with here, one Vera, two Vera, and here you see this. Now, now here, the question here, what, how you can do that using regular expression. If you go with the like expression, right? What it does, like expression, it does generally, it is going to do the regular expression, like nothing but it. Suppose if I do AV, it's what it does, it is going to run, it is going to give to the, okay, wherever capital AV is present, irrespective of the, irrespective of the place, whether it can be starting, whether it can be ending, it doesn't matter, it is going to run, it is going to fetch. Now, same thing, what you have to do here, as part of this particular thing. So, what is the thing which you have to do Specifically, how you have to do. Try to ex let me try to explain in detail. So, regular expression take it takes the column name along with the expression which is going to take along with the expression it is going to take. Now, when you when you go with this particular thing, right? So, try to understand first what it what it means. First, you are going to open the bracket. You are going to open the bracket within the bracket. What you are saying dot means dot means. It can be any character. It can be any character. Are you with me? here? It can be any character. Dot means it can be any character. Star means star means what it does means star means it is it can be it can be it can be followed up with it can be followed with any any one or more occurrence one or more occurrence. Okay, that is what that is what it does. That is what. That is what it does. Okay. So, so here, what does it mean? Star, dot means it can be, it can be, it can be this part, that particular part of the expression, right? It can be anything. It can be anything. Okay. When it comes to star means zero or more times, more times. Okay. Zero or more times, zero or more times, which you are going to follow, which you are going to follow okay zero or more times now now what do you mean by two two means it's nothing but a, these two e should be present e should be present two characters two characters which is going to be 
present okay and it shouldn't be followed it shouldn't be followed with e it shouldn't be followed with e it's nothing but this is the caret symbol okay caret symbol this is the list comprehension which we are going to use it within this particular thing whatever the characters after two e is present it shouldn't be followed with e it shouldn't be followed with e that is what i have mentioned here within this particular brackets as well as caret caret is nothing but if you do like this if you do like this what it does it is going to be it is going to followed with e but if you go with this particular if you go with this particular thing it it means it meant it's kind of it shouldn't be followed with e and it can be any character and it should be ended it should be ended this is the way this is the way you have to you have to do this particular expression so to summarize it very simple simple way we are using the regular expression like which we are passing the, the particular column and it has to go with that it has to go it can be any character at start and any anywhere it can be starting or it can be ending doesn't matter but it should be it should be zero or more times zero or more times zero or more times e present this e, e is present whose and here what you are checking here you are checking the these two it is nothing but it is a two times e e should be present two times okay e should be present two times and it shouldn't be followed with e and it's nothing but it can be zero or more correct more times and here you can see you can see here end dollar is nothing but end of that particular column end of that particular column so here you can see this is the output which you are going to get it so some of the guys which i have asked this question they have gone with this approach okay for example select star from employee select star from this particular table sample table within that what they are doing okay what they are doing where okay where within that where what they have done for example they thought of it length of length of name length of name okay length of name okay minus length again okay length again replace okay replace okay again here what you are doing what you are doing within the replace what is the thing which you have to do name and what characters you wanted to replace you wanted to replace e okay small e and then with the what it's kind of you know empty string empty string once you've done that then you are going to check it out okay what is the length of it then what what people thought of it if i can give two here i'm going to get i'm going to get i'm going to get what is the desired output desired output now if you see here if you see here you are going to get only only incorrect result incorrect results okay this is the way you are going to see you are going to see okay this is the incorrect results which you are going to get it as part of the output as part of the output you need to make sure you need to make sure use the a right approach using the regular expression you will be able to and you will be able to do this particular activity you will be able to do this particular activity so so this is the way you have to you have to go with it this is not the right approach this is not the right approach because this is not the right approach which you are going to follow which you are going to follow make sure make sure you are going to you are going to use this particular approach you are going to do this particular approach okay this is the way you have to do that you have to do that guys thank you guys have a good uh, please share and subscribe the channel as well thank you